Yes, hello from Edinburgh. Yeah, I'm outside the Middle Bank for uh, Leith Athletic. Also that you know the old Leith Athletic name I worked with guys in Miller's Foundry at the time and they were Leith Athletic supporters so yep. everybody in Leith was Leith Athletic yep. it wasn't even Hibs in the till the early 50s mid 50s yeah. so uh, I thought I'll go with that history and it's been a great history so yeah. we we got actually the original company stamp away back in 1996 and um, to pass on the legacy to us. So we've been yeah. doing that proudly for 27 years now. That's right, because I know that you've got Persevere, obviously, the, the Leaf motto and yes, the town course, and the yes. crest and all the yes, rest of, of it. Course, so yes, yes, it's, it's just uh, a completely thing. Yeah. Uh, so we started it back in 1996 and uh, 27 years later we're here. So yeah. we've got kids from four year old right up to 18 at youth right, level. Yeah. We've got an under 20s team that come up to the first team and also an amateur team. So yeah. we've got about 550 players just now. Amazing, and uh, this team here tonight is just a continuation. You know, we're always like to internally promote. So we've got a lot of kids through their 18s yeah. or our 20s teams to come through here and play for the big two. Managers, for example, played with us at youth level. Right. The youth coaches still coach the right. youths, and uh, you know, so we like to just keep things. Yeah, so it's most of the sponsors are Leith, and most of the uh, coaches are Leith. Yeah. You know, the ones that are coming through the systems. Well, let's kick off. I should have said that Leith is like a Corinna, the usual black and white strips, the traditional strips, and people's uh, rovers are in their red strips. Oh, oh I go go far all day, huh? Oh, 
first time they were game to people and they took a shot one. Oh, it's a shot. That was. That was close. So both teams are fun. A good chance each. Oh. oh, that was been far away. Good defending at the end of the day. Oh. No. The people that are doing the half press are pushing up, they're, they're hassling all the time, uh, they're matching with the Athletic. Another, another corner, that's the same corner. Nope. Nope. We can, there's maybe somebody in the, uh, one of the coaches. Must have said something, obviously. First booking of the game, it doesn't go to your player, it goes to one of the coaching team. Uh, I just remember that's a way, so that'll be the people's, the people's dugout. Ah, right to the goal. Where's that? Oh, oh I'm going to get that one here. Huh? Oh, there's a corner again. That's a third corner for pe people. Oh, oh, we can see a bit of goalie. Oh, right to the goalie. Oh, this time, there's no offside. Oh, there's offside. I was going to say, this time, that's the third time we've been offside, and uh, I thought this time it wasn't going to be given offside, but it was. Oh, that was a good shot. Touch that as a corner to people's. I think that's a fourth corner. And uh, I think that's a relief I've had any yet. Oh. Oh, good team, there you go, Luke. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey guys, good to see you again. Yep. Hey Gary, how's it going? Back, back, back. Uh, cause you're place for Leith and Fly, okay? So you're here, well, you're here supporting Aye, your Leith. Aye, uh, 13th goal, eh? So I got to be a ball boy and come watch the game. That's good, it's a good setup, eh? Aye, yeah. good setup, aye. Aye, very good. It's good to see the other kids in as well. Do you want to say anything about the game then? No, I find the uh, yeah. people's have been really good, eh? Aye, aye it's been alright game, like... Um, We've always had a few saves to make, uh, quite a range for us, so. Yeah. And we've been offside a few times, but... Aye. They could have scored hard in those three or four. Yeah. Uh, but keepers kept them in it. Uh, same at the other end, good couple of strikes. Yeah. But the presence now, now, hopefully some goals in the second half. I think so. Yeah. Craig? Yeah, it's, it's, it's been, it's obviously goalless at the break, but I mean... There's, there's definitely been chances at both ends. I think Leaf could have scored about three or four. Aye. Uh, some good goalkeeping, some yes. good kind of close range saves, and a few kind of missed efforts. But you know, people's look dangerous on the break as well. They do. Uh, I think Leaf have been sitting far too deep at times. They need to they need to move forward a bit and obviously put uh, people's under a bit more pressure. But Aye. that's been good for a nil now. It's been quite good. It so has far, been good, yeah. eh? I'm enjoying joined by Ryan as well. How are you doing, Ryan? Good to see you. How you doing? Uh, what did they get the game? I just caught the end of what Craig was saying there. I think I, even though it's 0 no, no, it's been a decent game. Chances at both ends. Goalies have made a couple of decent saves. I think Leaf have probably been a wee bit wasteful in the goal, but. Do you, do you think it's because people have been hard pressed, they've been forcing mistakes on uh, Leaf, I think? I mean, I haven't seen neither team play. Um, but you know, people's I think have people's been, have been well organised. Been getting men behind the ball. I think you've seen on the least last attack. I think people's have six, yeah. six uh, defenders. So. Well, great, great seeing you guys, and uh, I'm looking forward to the second half. Yep. Oh, cheers. Well, I believe the idea that the flask there. It's quite right. And these women have the right idea as well with the blanket. Right, right. Oh, so the ones just to get underway. No more. But it's been a good game. A lot of good chances. Uh, so I think we oh, no. some goals. There's a, a line over the brawler. Uh, again, they don't have, they don't have a referee. They don't have a uh, line one from each team is the right. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, good job. Oh, no. Right. 
There's a player down injured, so we can watch these wee guys playing football right there. Pass that bomb, yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Eh? Oh, oh. 
see if Bush can do something here. Yeah. Fun. A couple of people's <laughs> fun here. So what do you think of the game then? Well done to people. Ah, it was good. Uh, hard fought. Sending off. Help people's I think. Uh, it was pretty evenly matched. It was. Like I say, just 
Thought it was pretty even, what? It was, it was even. I mean, the problem with a draw and penalties, it was looking like it was going to be penalties, you know? Yeah. Aye, well done. Kind of held on a bit at the end. The second half, I thought it was a bit flat, you know? Yeah, I think it was, uh, it died down a bit, um, but sent an off. It looked like uh, close line to be able to put it. was no need for it, I think it was just uh, losing that man, it just completely killed it. So yeah, I think it did. Uh, but that said, I thought like, people were going down very, very easily. Aye. They were falling over the place and there wasn't really much football in the second half. No, no. A few chances, but I think I think Leaf will be kicking themselves with, you know, chances on the first half. And if Definitely. they'd kept that, they'd kept 11 men on the pitch, yeah. it could have been different. But, you know, That's fair right. play, people did what they've done. So they got through, so they're still a good, they're a very good team, so I thought it was a decent opposition. To yeah, play. I thought Fields were well organised to do yeah, that, and yeah. that was the difference. But yeah. you're right though, at least had chances, particularly in the end of the first half there. Mm. Um, yep. But their goalie it was good to be fair. Very, enough. very good, he, he so, kept them in the game a lot, and then, as I say, they knew how to run the clock down, they controlled that in the right end of the pitch, so Leaf, Leaf will be gutted, but oh, uh, you know, you got to take your chances. Eh? Definitely, right. Well, thanks for watching. Just a few thank yous. Uh, it was really interesting uh, speaking to Alan McDonald from Peebles Rovers, uh, explaining a bit of the history of the club. Just in speaking to Ger Friedman, the chair and the founder member of the current Leaf Athletic. I, I, I think I was, I was trying to go over uh, the, the importance that we hold on uh, the keeping the badge and the tradition alive of uh, the town of Leith. Uh, there was a lot of resentment at the time when Leith joined Edinburgh, and I think it was 1923 or thereabouts. Um, I think it was even a, a referendum or some sort of plebiscite, and they didn't want to join Edinburgh. And there was a lot of resentment, and there's still a lot of pride if you come from Leith. And I think that comes through, it in the Leith Athletic Football Club. Uh, so if you're a Leither, you've got a club there.